Hello, people of your welcome to Mr. Who Reviews. Today I'm doing the second Record Ralph movie, Ralph Breaks the Internet. Uh, this takes place uh, six, seven years from the first one, and Penelope is just getting a bit bored with her game. As he says, he done everything that is to be done, and it's getting too predictable. The Ralph actually likes just doing the same thing over and over again. So it make her happy he decides to build a new track for her. Uh, it turns out that they doing it while somebody's playing the game Candy something. Um, the, then the game just gets broken and the game gets unplugged because uh, the guy can't really get new parts since uh, the part he needed was the steering wheel uh, was uh, isn't really available since the company made it uh, went out of business a long time ago and they did find one on ebay but it would cost too much so Penelope and the other uh, residents of the game are gameless not like homeless so they're set to sell off uh, some of the characters of the game or just uh, put in another game for them. Uh, Fix of Felix and his wife decided to take all 15 of the kids. Yep. And uh, Ralph is thinking that maybe. Uh, and Penelope's go on the internet to eBay to find another wheel since uh, the guy that uh, runs the arcade that's connected to the internet. Yeah. But uh, when they actually get to eBay, they think it's just uh, a place where you say the highest number and whoever says the highest number wins the thing they're bidding on. So they have to get a lot of money when the the person that's given that's supposed to give them the wheel the steering wheel so that they need the uh, cash. So to go to this uh, uh, I think guy that's uh, promoting how to get rich by playing video games. So basically, does the same thing from other games and giving it for money. So I decided to steal this uh, car from this. Uh, Runji uh, racing game that Penelope seems to like. And it seems like the the player or the owner of the car that they're about to steal. And just a uh, still a good ass racing moment. And since the uh, the character uh, I, I can't your name is Sh uh, as Shiv or something, I don't know. Yeah, well she just feels that bad for the two, so she makes a viral video of Ralph doing something and then just point her to uh, a friend of hers called Yes, who can help uh, make more videos and uh, just get more money quicker since they have a time limit of when to get the wheel. Uh, was it me or to make uh, Ralph uh, dumber than in the first movie and a lot more goofy? Eh, I don't know. Anyway, one of the best parts has to be when uh, Cloudy is going to uh, the, the Disney part, Disney part of the internet. Just, what did you just guess? I just hear uh, Let It Go being played and Buzz Lightyear. I guess he bumps into Stanley. Huh. I miss him. And see, yes, he gets uh, some people to check out uh, Ralph's uh, video, but then gets caught by some stormtroopers. And yes, he meets the other Disney princesses. Even though some of them are technically princesses like uh, Elsa and Moana. And uh, just uh, 
making fun of some of the stereotypes that zero that Disney princesses like are known for. Um, there's the trying to get Flappy to find her songs and yeah, as well. See, he is technically a Disney princess, so she does need to have a song or something. Her first attempt, it her attempt is kind of bad. But her second attempt of a song, I'm just doing the full one. It's uh, good, but I think some other songs were a bit better. And um, just so that her dream is to go back to the uh, the racing game that she seen Ralph ran before, but she's just worried about how Ralph would take it. And there's a bit foreshadowing when uh, Ralph went into this uh, um, building called the Common Section, and he hears all bad comments. And yes, so tell them the first rule about the internet don't read the comments. And he was saying he doesn't really care as long as uh, Penelope likes him, then that's all he needs. Um, then I think got a little predictable when uh, Ralph actually uh, heard Penelope talking to the racer character so uh, she wanted to stay in the game and. Uh, Ralph is wor worried about losing her. So he gets uh, the guy he's talking to before to bring him to this uh, other guy that can give him a virus that can spread uh, insecurities or flaws in a uh, different uh, person in that. Um, man, does he look weird? It's. Anyway, the, 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 the thing I thought happened would happen, the, the virus thing uh, just like, locks on to Penelope's insecurity and um, Ralph just realized what's happening since he, since he, since the virus actually uh, used her a uh, glitch to destroy the game and the game has to do, do reboot with since Penelope in the part of the game or a code isn't, she probably die and Ralph goes in and then when he saves her she's Feeling like it's her fault that the game went wrong, but he reveals what he did, and see, of course, is angry and breaks the hero heart thing that she gave him. And of course, since Ralph's upset that uh, the lizard virus thing copies uh, his uh, insecurity and just unleashes uh, the insecurity on the on everything and turns everybody into like a red eyed the uh, Ralph that keeps him friend. Yeah, at this point it, it had a bit of a sequel itis, but only a little. Um eventually somehow there's like a King Kong giant giant Ralph so do the others just like a mesh together to make the use version of Ralph or what? I don't really get it. Hey, there's this good scene where uh, the giant Ralph has Ralph in his, in his arm or hand or and Plowby decides to give herself up a Ralph and um, do it but then the same that's trying to get uh, the John Ralph to calm down, understand that everything will be okay. I start falling and the Disney princesses actually save Ralph and I think they're playing uh, the music to their dead songs while they're doing that and that was just great. Um, Ralph is saved and the virus Ralphs are gone. Um, let's see, yeah. there's a, a good moment where Ralph just gives uh, maybe half of the hero heart thing towards symbolizing that they'll be uh, friends forever or something maybe. Mm -hmm. Um, 
see the result goes off that, that uh, hardcore racing game. Um, Ralph said that Tom probably was he's why he been ulti like joined a book club or just said uh, hanging out with other uh, game uh, play game uh, characters and then just agreeing to me up at uh, one point that uh, I'm not damn Ralph and Felix was go off. Oh yeah, somehow uh, Felix and his wife were able to turn the racers nicer. Yeah, they they tried to explain uh, what they did, but the seven cars just goes by coming here. It's probably a joke, but... Mm. Um, yeah, it's a good movie, but I don't know why Sonic was in this. He had two cameos in, in this movie. Like, in the first one, just have him uh, talking on like a, a board game, a PSA or something. I don't think uh, Sonic had an arcade game out at any point, but maybe he did. Um, just, uh, the, I think the relationship between uh, Ralph and Cloudy is good. I think it's uh, more than a best friend father thing. I think a best friend, I think it's like a father, father daughter thing. And I think the Razor character was a uh, does imply that when the uh, Ralph made a joke and she's saying you know, a good dad joke or something like that. So, yeah. I don't know. Uh, this goes to seeing the Disney princesses in this. It just seems funny how they're mocking some of their tropes and just uh, mocking them. Merida as well from Brave. Because they don't understand what she's saying because she's Scottish. Ugh, that's, that's funny. Um, I don't know if Pilate needed to have a song to sing about, sing about in this, but as I said, it's okay. It could have been worse, but. Mm -hmm. And also, as I said, I think I might have dumbed down Ralph in this. And I don't know, like, I kind of get why they, they, some of the characters come uh, a hobo. But why would they all say that? Wouldn't they say something different? But, eh, you know. Um, um, hopefully they, they might make a third one, and hopefully it's that uh, good, or it's uh, okay, since sometimes a third movie in a trilogy can be very bad, or just okay, but whatever. Um, the lot of the characters in this are good as well and I think they uh so the so the good like uh they like uh, so the in the in the good and bad way or or I think it was the same what I said there some they saw the good and the bad on the internet. And the character being the uh Sir Spar was just uh, great as well. Just wanna be tanked by uh, the people that are that are looking for things. Uh, don't know. Um, 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 did nobody uh, notice, uh, like, would nobody notice if uh, Penelope wasn't in her game anymore? Just wondering. Like, he said, she's in the order game, like, permanently since he said that the Razor uh, made a code for her, so she won't, she won't, uh, get d deleted if the game uh, has to do a reboot again. So uh, any of the kids in the arcade gotta wonder where Penelope is. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, uh, can't really think of anything else to say, so uh, until next time, I'm Sue, see you guys later.